Hey, what's up guys? Welcome to part 22 of our Warhammer 3 Immortal Empires Repons campaign. We're going to pick up right where we left off. We're just uh, preparing for this invasion of Scarbrand the Exiled here. So we're just uh, sort of rallying our troops and uh, and getting ready for this uh, shitstorm that's about to... <laughs> About to uh, head our way. Um, yes. Zandri has a small force here. Um, but, uh, yeah, I'm not... Obviously, obviously peasants versus um, Forsaken. Not going to go super well. Um, even with these guys. Um, could have some uh, could have some issues, but you know who I am? let's uh, let's figure out what we're gonna do here, how we're gonna organize this. I think what we want to do Beast is Slayer. let's put you out simple. here in in camp stance, just to get a little bit of a um, melee defense bonus for our cavalry here. Um, we'll also recruit some. Regiments of renown. Just give us a little bit, um, a little bit more force there. My reputation. Proceeds. Um, and then I think you will force march you into the Sorry, settlement before. here. But we're gonna put these guys into, into the. Mm, it's a little bit risky. But I want, I want these guys to. Oh shit! Can they? I oh, can't reach. God damn it. God damn it. I wanted to put them in Gautric's army. Shit. Shit, I screwed that up. Can you move a little bit closer? Guardian. Alright, yeah, we should be able to get them in there. Uh, just because I don't want them in Force March. My lady, honor me. Um... And we we'll, we'll want um, we we'll want these guys to get that um, I will lead by example. that melee defense bonus as well. So these guys will fight a little bit better. These guys are going to be key in surviving this shitstorm. Same thing with the cavalry. The only the only Our issue is thing. that um, or one of the issues is that these guys aren't going to show up on the battlefield right away. Lord so um, we've kind of got to hold the line here with these dudes. Noble. These dudes, though the um, these guys should be able to hold them off long no. enough for us to get their reinforcements on. Let's bring you over as well. Um, it shall be so. Let's leave you in regular march. Bring you over as well. So that. Do you know who I am? So one, two, three, Protector and then the, the garrison room. is four. So that's the maximum amount of guys that can uh, participate in that battle. This dude, I don't think he can reach anyway. So let's just bring him on a regular march. It would have been nice to have him in the fight rather than uh, this guy. This guy's only level two. But uh, we'll take, take what we can get. Um, yeah, I'd, My ideally I'd like to transfer these guys over. Actually, maybe we can. All right, yeah, we can actually do that. Uh, just so that they're My in here. So these guys are in yours. force march, but anyway, I have to be good enough. Um, and then I'm thinking, I'm thinking that we should recruit some more knights of the realm here. Um, let's do a little bit of building first. There's. Um, Got the opportunity to build here. Um, all right, maybe that's all the building we'll do, and then recruit some more, uh, some more of these, so that we have. Um, I will indulge you. Have a little bit extra. So I don't know. Hopefully, that's enough to um, to hold them off. I'm not sure. Um, yeah, we'll see. We'll see if he makes the invasion. It might be enough to deter, to uh, deter him from making the invasion. You guys probably just stay put here for now. Um, what have we got going on in the north here? So in the north, did we moved these guys already. Um, I don't believe we have, so I think it's, it must be at the first of the turn. 
So get him over here to scout. We want to uh, get an idea what's happening over here. I mean, it's not ideal using. Um, using the green knight for uh, for scouting, but um, it is what it is. Protector of the realm. What does it say? Oh, he's in the settlement. Uh, I thought he was in encampment stance there for a second. Uh, damn it, would have been nice to build here. And it will continue moving over here. Let's uh, just move right to the border. Because we can't quite reach it this turn, can we? My reputation precedes me. Actually, we can. Don't be a fool. What are we up against here? Ooh, it's pretty... Pretty have a garrison. But we do have... Um, Fate is my armor. That shouldn't be an issue. Well, we're in decent enough shape to take them on. For the lady! A lot of a lot of guns though. That's the uh Honor and, and uh, the artillery piece. What's uh what's in this for us? That is Not forbidden. Much. The Leoness! Leoness, let's get you up here as well. I will Blessings of the Lady be upon you. Yeah, bring you over here too. Taking my leave. How much winds of magic? Shit. How what much winds of magic do you have? Oh my gosh, that's terrible. That freaking sucks. All right. I serve the lady. And let's get you over I here. My path. Might be better actually if we have Rapunz attack the um. To victory! Ah, fuck it. We'll just attack with this guy. We could probably... Oh, I was going to say, we could probably auto-resolve this, but um, maybe not. Medium casualties. Alright. Settle in for a siege, boys. Probably take uh, most of the episode here, so we'll have to... With Scarbrand, we'll have to probably wait till next time. We'll see, see if we can get through it relatively quickly. Um, Alright, so they've got three artillery pieces that'll need to be taken out. Um, we just have to be careful of their ranged, their ranged units while we do that. Alright, so Toza, yeah, we. I think we'll have a much, um, much more difficult challenge against the. Um, ah, shit! Our reinforcements coming in here. Against the Skaven, I think the Skaven will present a, a much uh, stiffer, much stiffer resistance. Though it depends, though the, Sk the Skaven could potentially be. Um, Oh, okay, this is perfect. The reinforcements coming in here. There's actually no towers here. Um, that's kind of nice. I'm thinking we'll take out this tower with our archer that's set up in the corner here. And yeah, the Skaven may, um, may be off in another province somewhere. It could potentially be... Um, Ready to launch! moving towards um, the other Bretonian factions. So if that's the case, then... Um, Spearmen at arms! And up front there. Just end there. That the if that's the case, then it would be pretty easy to take their territory, but we'll have to we'll have to wait and see. Get our scouts uh, to take a look. Alright, make sure you guys are all on guard mode. Get off fire at will. Alright, so let's take this. Release. Take this out.
Yeah, well, we need we will need to take out those mortars, but the, it's gonna it's not gonna be easy because they've got a lot of guns. Um, deck gunners. We got mortars over there as well. Fuck. Wonder if they'll um, will the mortar shoot at this dude? If we can move up into range of their mortars. The, it's the days where the uh, the AI would just target the first thing they saw. Um, makes things so much easier. Yeah, because if we drop down here with our flying unit, we're going to have a fucking problem um, because of the guns. Not to mention all of the, uh, the units over here. This could be tricky. I don't know. I don't know what the best way to go about this is. And we don't have uh, a lot of uh, Winds of Magic Reserve either. Some deck droppers there. Could be a problem. I think we'll wait for... Um, at least wait for our reinforcements, at the very least. Alright. Um, what's next for the artillery? Guys, just park over here for now. I mean, we could sneak through the back door with our with our cav, shake things up. We are ready. Questing knights. Take the ground. Show us the foe. They don't have. Um, not units over there. Anyway, let's just get organized a little bit. Yeah, so we've only got the two flying units. Damn, I don't know what the best way to go about this is. I mean, we... Could come through the back door. Let's, uh... Let's go for there. Go for that, and, um... And you guys around too. You guys come around this way. All right, we got a mortar over here we could potentially take out. Thinking if we could uh, capture and hold this, then we could avoid actually fighting with most of these guys. Let's see if they actually um, actually move here. Um, in the meantime, guys, um, give me a breach in the wall here. Guys, go for those mortars. I don't know what they did with the other mortars. Should actually probably try and take out these deck droppers. Are the mortars? What are the mortars shooting at here? Are oh, they shooting at these two dudes? That's fine. Let's actually, take out uh, take out the deck droppers first. Yeah, because I think um, we could probably hold these with our cavalry long enough to actually um, actually capture the or get the uh, the victory tickets whatever it's called um, and maybe avoid having to battle through all of these guys and then okay we got okay we got shot by the tower there how is this coming along and we're almost through Go, 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 go. So this goes. Go for those handguns. Right. You might as well get into those mortars now. Alright, at least this dude's got a uh, potion of healing there. We 
we're gonna get a little bit of a traffic jam. Where's response? You two moving. Are you, uh, is our, uh, it's on horseback, right? Alright, so far so good. Only issue is, uh, ah, this is an issue here. Alright, let's get over, go kill him and then capture that. Moving. Where's the capture point for this thing? God damn it, why is this not capturing? That's weird. I don't know why it's Alright, a few of you come over here and capture this because we wanna we wanna start that uh, that timer. And how are we doing over here? Alright, you get back in the air. Back them. Let's keep moving. Capture this. She reports. You head over for this one. Oh, come this way. Head that way for that. And you guys keep moving. Fight for the lady. Yeah, they're moving their forces. Um, but whether or not. Alright, you guys I'm actually get over here. Whether or not they'll be able to recapture it in time remains to be seen. Knights of the ring. Brave knights. All of you over here. You guys come capture this. Ooh, we got some mortars there. Um, mortars shouldn't hurt the. Um, shouldn't really hurt the. Uh, the cavalry so much. Anyway, let's just uh, set up a defense here. Capturing this one soon. They battle without honor. Orders. My blade is yours. All right, these guys might be. All right, probably should get out of here. Let's uh get out of this situation. It would have been nice to uh take out those um. Those mortars, but I, I think um, just the risk of getting stuck here be a little bit too much. And anyway, we're distracting these guys, which is good. There's another guy over there. You guys come over here. Yeah, I think this will be no problem. I think we've almost uh, just about got it. Nobody's coming for this area. We got repawns here. Let's actually, let's bring the two of you over here. We'll get healed up a little bit. What do you mean? And you guys stay put there. What do you These guys are having a hard time killing this down. dude, but he's almost dead. Yeah, and I, I don't think there's there's much chance of them getting these forces into position to retake these positions. Guys, come Coming back here. What? Full tilt. Kill the ladies yeah, we're almost, almost in the clear. To the street. That actually worked out pretty well. We didn't have to. Um, we have to do a proper siege. Take a little bit of damage, but I. I don't think it's. Uh, Yeah. 
Yeah, see, the we nice thing is the these guys are nice and slow. So the disadvantage of having, like, these large settlements to defend with a, uh, with a force that's not very mobile. Feel true power. The grail vow is I just will pop this as well. There we go. Easy game, easy life. Worked out really well. Only 26 losses. We didn't have to grind them down. And uh, the mortars were basically a non-factor. Yeah, it would have been nice just to get him a little bit healed. But uh, I should recover most of that in the end turn, though. Trait gain, confident attacker. Trait gained. Alright. Very well. Alright, uh, probably don't need that, even though I do kind of like this building, but um, I think there's better stuff that we can probably build. Uh, this actually provides income, so I guess that's not a terrible building to build. And then I guess we'll build the um, standard fields here, make this an economic hub. Alright, you yes. sir. We're going to give you... Um, Foe Seeker probably wouldn't be too bad. Seeker loss. Yeah, that's not too bad. Uh, let's give you Blessing of the Lady. My reputation All right. precedes me. Get you some... Get you a little bit tougher. I have seen your heart. And our King Conduit sounds good. And Rapunce. The Leoness! Alright, um, a wound maker probably. Yeah, let's go wound maker. We'll just put low. Alright, looking good, looking good. I see much. Valiant Lord. All right, yeah, the uh, parts of Sartosa are all oh, but mermaid. defeated. So I'm not, not too keen on peace. But anyway, so I'll just... Yeah. Finish off the pirates and then get into position to take out Skaven Blight. Uh, Skaven Blight, pretty big garrison, but like I said, if the Skaven are off elsewhere, um, I have a feeling that they're probably... Let's take a look at the... Uh, Corruption. Let's give them corruption and see if we can get an idea where they are. What the hell? There we go. Yeah, so it looks like they're um they've invaded this area. I don't know why it's uh God, yeah, it looks like they're all the way up to here. It's like the Bretonians are up to their neck in Skaven. They could be, um, could be quite, quite strong. What's their um, their strength ranking? Clan Squire. Settlement's 10. So if we uh, take a look here. So 1, 2, 3. I think there's one here. 4, 5, 6. Yeah, they're definitely, they're definitely into Bretonian territory. So hopefully their armies are up there. Um, Strength-wise... They're pretty, um... 
pretty even. Pretty even. We don't. At least we've got our strongest forces over here. But taking Skaven Blight would be pretty huge. We can prevent them from getting um, elite armies. That would be. That would be pretty huge for us. Uh, let's get this built here. Oh, um, and now we can control here. All right, looking good. Slow and steady. Situation seems uh, seems under control. It's just yeah, Scarbrand. How is that going to go with Scarbrand? That's the question. This guy's only level one. Um. Oh, we do. We should have a scout over here, shouldn't we? Okay. We got this dude here. All oh, right, we're, we're using uh, using Felix as a scout. All right, let's send you this way. We do want to keep an eye on this army, but it looks like Valkmar potentially is going to engage them. I think I think Scarbrand's just got the two armies: this army and this army. I think. The Chronicler. But it's hard to say. We want to move towards this. How big is the garrison here? I'm just wondering. Hmm. These two should be able to take that on. Wondering, let's maybe start moving out with this force. Um, we'll move slowly. Uh, just so we can get a little bit more replenishment along the way. Fuck, that's not very much replenishment. You know what, maybe it's... Maybe it's better just to stay in here, get fully replenished, and then move out. Um, we got access to some peasants. All right, I think we're. Uh, I, th I think this is about as good as it's gonna get for this situation. Just quick check the uh, diplomacy. I, I wouldn't mind getting non-aggression with him. Iron um, Defender of truth. Who calls? Four princes. Yeah. All right. My strength and wisdom are yours. Yeah, you uh, sit tight for now. Building upgrade available. Oh, shit. Um, yeah, probably we'll build the windmill, so we'll wait till we get this upgraded first. We'll wait till next turn. Oh, look at this. You can even... Uh, even auto resolve it. Ah, oh, fuck. He's attacking Gotrick, though. Fuck me. That's annoying. It's really, really annoying. Um. Well. We're gonna lose. I think I'm just gonna auto resolve this. I was gonna fight it. But, um. Hey, auto resolve's giving us a good result. <laughs> Scarbrand dealt with. Um, all right, so uh, we can, uh, we're free to invade his territory now. Uh, we got through that with, um, <laughs> um, it may not be the most popular decision. Um, I'm surprised that he did that. Surprised that he made that attack. That's, uh, very interesting. Yeah, so we'll, we'll try and get on Scarbrand and, uh, see if we can put up the pressure against him. We've got a pretty strong force down there now. We should uh, we shouldn't have too much difficulty getting rid of them. Though, fuck, how does corn recruit their troops? With the same like. Same like regular chaos warriors of chaos. Do they recruit them or go? Balkmar making some gains. Look at this, tomb kings. Surviving at Stormhedge. Um, that actually is something probably we should address because the Tomb Kings can... Um, they, they have no upkeep on their armies, right? So they'd probably be able to field... Field probably three armies. Maybe four. 
So we probably want to want to get over there and get rid of them before they uh, build up their forces too much. But uh, looking good. Weapon strength plus eight. Ah, man. So freaking uh, Gotrek is the one who got the trait. Unicorn. All right, yeah. Um, I'm wondering if we maybe sail around this way and hit Storm Hedge, and then come down here to take this. This whole province has been bombed. I'm wondering. See, all all this terrain is um, wasteland. It's gonna be a pain in the ass to uh, to occupy. But yeah, we should definitely get rid of the Tomb Kings before they can build up. Um, so I might come over here, maybe come over here and land here. And then make our way to uh, to deal with... Deal with corn. Otherwise we could... Ah, oh, shit. I mean to do that. Anyway. Um, and then up here... These idiots, they freaking, uh, that sucks that they seized it out there, because it, um, it prevented these guys from getting replenishment. Shit, I should maybe shouldn't have auto-resolved that. Oh, it's just the garrison, really, that took damage. Took the cash. All right, yeah, we'll have to uh, we'll have to run him down and Against the get rid of those guys. But uh, anyway, guys, I think that's uh, this is where we're gonna leave it. We're gonna push towards Skaven Blight. I'm hoping that the Skaven armies are not um, not in the area, and that we can um, slowly make our way around here. That hopefully the Skaven armies are bogged down up here in um, in Bretonia. Though I don't know, can they? Use the underway to get over to here? Shit, I don't know if that... I I don't know. Anyway. Anyway, we'll figure it out. Lots of work to do, guys. Um, thank you very much for watching. Have yourselves a great day, and I'll see you next time. Ragnarok, signing out.